The capra goats live in some of the most difficult and dangerous mountain habitats on the face of the earth. To complete a capra world slam of 12 is one of the most difficult, physically challenging accomplishments in the mountain hunting world. Tonight, we want to honor several individuals who have reached this milestone. Washington's Brian Bailey began his quest for an eventual Capra World Slam in 2001 with an American mountain goat from his home state of Washington. In 2014, Brian traveled to Pakistan where he took a Himalayan Ibex. Brian is both the tar and chamois found in New Zealand, which he got in 2017. And Brian achieved his Capra World Slam in Spain back in 2019 with the Southeastern Ibex. It was a Ronda Ibex from his home country of Spain that got Johnny Burby to the Capra World Slam. Johnny has recently been going after the Capra Goats over the past couple of years and is only three away from the Capra Super 20. He saw his Pyrenean Chamois from Spain taken in 2016 and in 2018 he took a mid-Asian Ibex in Kyrgyzstan. We'll finish up with Johnny's most recent Capra entry, an Alpine Chamois from France taken in 2020. Denmark's Thomas Buckholz achieved his Capra World Slam in 2019 with a Cantabrian Chamois from Spain. Thomas has both the Tar and Chamois from New Zealand, which got him started on his Capra journey. Thomas took all four of the Ibex found in Spain on the same hunt in 2017, and we chose his Pesedi Ibex as it was quite impressive. We'll finish up by showing you the mountain goat Thomas got in BC to round out his presentation here tonight. Bill Campbell of Alaska is up next for his Capra World Slam, and we'll start with his Bezor Ibex from Turkey taken in 2015. The following year, Bill traveled to Tajikistan, where he took the highly desirable Bukharan Markur. Bill's Gritos Ibex from Spain is up next, and he took it in 2018. Bill achieved his Capra World Slam in November 2019 with the Balkan Chamois from Croatia. Connie de Jong of the Netherlands began his quest for an eventual Capra World Slam back in 1987 with an Alpine Chamois from Austria and completed it 29 years later with a great Basedi Ibex from Spain in 2016. Connie's well on his way to a Capra Super 20. In 2018, he added the Kuban Western Tour from Russia to his Capra list and in 2019, he traveled to Mongolia to get his most recent entry a fine Altai Ibex. South Dakota's Rick Leitheiser is up next, and we'll start with his Dagestan Eastern Tour from Azerbaijan, which he got back in 2006. Rick has four chamois to his credit, and his Balkan from Macedonia was taken in 2010. Rick traveled to British Columbia in 2015 to get his American Mountain Goat, and he achieved his Capra World Slam in 2016 with a great Kriegri Ibex from Greece. Annette Martin-Smith of the Netherlands achieved her Capra World Slam in 2018 with a Sind Ibex from Pakistan. Speaking of Ibex, Annette's taken several and her Bezor Ibex from Turkey taken in 2015 was quite impressive. She traveled to Mongolia in 2017 to get her Altai Ibex and that same year she got a great Carpathian Chamois on a hunt in Romania. Now a word from our great sponsors. Utah's Rich Papa Pietro is up next for Capra World Slam recognition. Rich has all four of the Ibex found in Spain, and we chose his Presidi from 2007 to represent those. Rich has both the New Zealand Tar and Chamois, which he got in 2009, and in 2013 he traveled to Switzerland, where he found success in taking an Alpine Ibex. We'll finish up by showing the great Bukharan Markur Rich took in Tajikistan in February of 2020. Sergei Pozenkovic of Belarus achieved his Capra World Slam in 2019 on a hunt in Spain with a Peridian Chamois. His first Capra species was a huge mid-Asian Ibex from Kyrgyzstan taken in 2012. The Altai Ibex is up next for Sergei, and he took it in Mongolia in 2018. 
So they took all four of Spain's Ibex on the same trip back in 2019, and we chose his Ronda Ibex to wrap up his presentation here tonight. Next, we'd like to recognize Tom Rice of Nevada for achieving his Capper World Slam. In 2010, Tom took an American mountain goat in British Columbia. He traveled to Spain in 2016 to get his Pyrenean chamois, and in 2018, he connected on an alpine ibex while hunting in Switzerland. Later that same year, Tom reached number 12 on the capper list when he got a Bezoar ibex on a hunt in Turkey. It was a 44-year journey from start to finish for John M. Searles and his capper world slam. John's first capper trophy was an American mountain goat from British Columbia taken back in 1972. John has both chamois found in Spain and we chose his Cantabrian to show here. John also has both Cabra trophies from New Zealand, and you see his tar here. John also has all four Ibex from Spain, and he took them on the same trip in 2014. We chose his Southeastern Ibex to highlight those species. Ross Stelter of Alberta is up next, and we'll begin with his American Mountain Goat from NWT taken back in 2007. Ross took a Dagestan Eastern tour in Azerbaijan in 2016, and the following year he traveled to Kyrgyzstan to get his mid-Asian Ibex. Ross has all four Ibex from Spain, and he took them all in 2019. We chose the Southeastern Ibex to show here. We're pleased to recognize North Carolina's John Teeter for completing his Capra World Slam on a multi-species hunt in Switzerland back in 2018. There, John was able to take both an Alpine Chamois and Alpine Ibex. Speaking of Ibex, John has seven of them on his Capra list, including the Gobi he took in Mongolia back in 2011. We'll wrap up John's presentation with the New Zealand tar taken in 2016. Now we'd like to move along to a select group of individuals who have achieved an archery Capra World Slam. Spain's Pedro Ampuero is quite the accomplished bow hunter and has joined a very short list of archery Capra World Slammers. As a matter of fact, Pedro was only the fourth bow hunter to ever achieve this prestigious accomplishment. You saw Pedro's first Capra entry earlier, a Gritos Ibex from his home country of Spain, taken back in 2009. Pedro achieved an almost impossible task of taking a Dagestan Eastern Tour with a bow in 2016, and later that same year, he arrowed an Alpine Chamois in France. Pedro completed his archery Capra World Slam in 2018 with an Altai Ibex from Mongolia. We'll be right back after these messages. Only in Spain we have the four types of ibexes. We have in Spain about 14 types of animal for hunting. Unlike any place I've ever seen. There are those who continue to hunt the difficult capper goats even after their original 12. For the tough of mind and body who do this, there are the milestones of the Capper World Slam Super 20 and Super 30, and we'll honor some of those people here tonight. It was a chartreuse chamois from France that got Giancarlo Buenti of Italy to number 20 on the Capra World Slam list. Backing up, you see Giancarlo with his Sind Ibex from Pakistan taken in 2009 and his American Mountain Goat from British Columbia, taken in 2010. Giancarlo has all three tur species found in the Caucasus Mountains, and his mid-Caucasian tur was quite impressive. Giancarlo is actually already working toward the Capra Super 30, and his most recent entry was his Himalayan Ibex taken this past February. Spain's Lucio Gonzalez completed his Capra Super 20 in 2019 with a Balkan chamois from Macedonia. 
One of his earliest camper entries was a Bezor Ibex from Turkey, taken back in 2015. Lucia has all four Ibex found in his home country of Spain, including the Gritos you see here. He also has all three Tur found in the Caucasus Mountains, and we chose his Kuban Western Tur to represent those. We'll finish you up by showing you Lucio's Himalayan tar from Nepal, which he got in 2018. We're pleased to recognize Alexei Kim of Russia for achieving the Capra Super 20. Number 20 for Alexei was his Cree Cree hybrid Ibex from Greece, taken in 2018. That same year, Alexei hunted the highly desirable Persian Desert Ibex in Iran. Alexei's quickly closing in on the Capra Super 30. He took a southeastern ibex in Spain in 2018, a Sindh ibex from Pakistan in 2019, and his most recent capper entry, an Anatolian chamois from Turkey, also came in 2019. Juan March of Spain is one of the few individuals who has taken all four species of markhor. His Suleiman markhor from Pakistan was number 20 on his capper list, and he took it in 2019. We also want to show Juan's Great Kashmir Markhor, also from Pakistan, taken in 2017. Backing up to some of Juan's earlier trophies, we have his Mid-Asian Ibex from Tajikistan, taken back in 2003, an Alpine Chamois from Austria, taken in 2013, and we'll finish up with Juan's Gobi Ibex from Mongolia, which he got in 2017. Mexico's Gervasio Negretti, is actually only two capper species away from achieving his capper super 30, but tonight we want to recognize him for reaching the super 20. You've been seeing some of Gervasio's capra trophies, and they include his Anatolian chamois from Turkey and Balkan chamois from Croatia, both taken in 2007. Gervasio also has two markhor, and his Suleiman from Pakistan came in 2014. Next up, a great mid Caucasian tour from Russia taken in 2015, and finally, you see Gervasio with his Persian Desert Ibex from Iran, taken in 2017. David Nogoreda of Spain is up next for the Camper Super 20, and will begin with his most recent Camper entry, a Chartreuse Chamois from France, taken in 2019. We'll back up to 2004 to show you David's Carpathian Chamois from Romania, and the following year David added an Aster Markor from Pakistan to his Camper list. Next up, you see David's Kuban Western Tour from Russia, taken in 2008. And finally, we have David's highly desirable Nubian Ibex from Sudan, taken back in 2012. Next, let's recognize Bill Nye of New York for achieving his Capra Super 20. First up, we have two of Bill's Capra trophies from Spain, a Mallorcan Wild Goat and Pyrenean Chamois, both taken in 2012. The following year, Bill added a Sind Ibex from Pakistan to his Capra list, and in 2016, he traveled to Mongolia to get the Altai Ibex. Bill completed his Capra Super 20 in 2017 with a Bezor Hybrid Ibex from Turkey. It was a Gobi Ibex from Mongolia taken in 2019 that got Russia's Evgeny Shudokov to the Capra Super 20. Backing up, you see Evgeny with his first Capra trophy, a mid-Asian Ibex from Kyrgyzstan taken in 2015. That's right, it only took him four years to reach the Capra Super 20. Afghani's Cantabrian Chamois from Spain came in 2018. He took both the New Zealand tar and Chamois on the same hunt in 2019. We'll finish up by showing Afghani's Bukharan Markor from Tajikistan, which he got in January of 2020. Next, we'd like to recognize Yuri Vasilev of Russia for achieving his Capra Super 20. First up, you see Yuri with his Pyrenean Chamois from Spain, taken in 2017. His Kuban Western Tour from Russia is up next, and it also came in 2017. In 2019, Yuri connected on a Chartreuse Chamois in France, a Bezor Ibex in Turkey, and he reached number 20 with a Mid-Asian Ibex from Kyrgyzstan. With a total of 24 Capra trophies to his credit, he has a great start toward the Capra Super 30.
We now want to recognize those individuals who have achieved a Capra World Slam Super 30. It was a Sendai Bex from Pakistan taken in 2019 that got Russia's Victor Kim to the Capra Super 30. Victor has hunted the world's mountains extensively over the past few years. He has all four Ibex in Spain, and we chose his Greedos to represent those. Victor has taken all the huntable chamois, and we have his Balkan from Macedonia and Cantabrian from Spain to highlight that category. As for the Ibex, Victor has most of those as well. He traveled to Mongolia in 2014 to get his 20th Capra species of Gobi Ibex. And we'll finish up by showing you the Himalayan tar Victor took in Nepal in 2018. Russia's Sergei Rostrimsky achieved his Capra Super 30 in 2019 on a hunt in Iran where he connected on a Persian desert ibex. Sergei has taken all the Capra species in Spain, including the Pyrenean chamois and Mallorcan wild goat. He traveled to New Zealand in 2015 to get the chamois and tar found there. In 2016, Sergei found success hunting mountain goats in British Columbia. And finally, we want to show you the Caucasian chamois from Russia Sergei collected in 2017.